Hi and welcome to Eskies World. It is that time of the month again and my let's hold it the other way over and my coffee direct coffee club um has come and in it this month I've got um I've got this chart which can you see that? Um, reflects to the colour of the coffee and then I suppose you hold a chart and you think which colour it's closest to which I think is probably this one here can you see I think it's probably this one here oh no actually this one this one well here possibly or this one and then actually this lime green up here can you see there anyway what the color chart has oh, it's my hair can you see all the different no you can't because i can barely see it and it just has the different flavors like nutty brown sugar cocoa but it sort of has like it has an inner wheel and on the inner wheel, you've got green vegetation, other roasted spice, nutty cocoa, sweet, floral, fruit, and sour fermented. And then on the next wheel, you've got paper, oh no, papery musty strange chemical pipe tobacco tobacco burnt cereal pungent pepper brown spice nutty cocoa brown sugar vanilla vanillin overly sweet sweet aromatics black tea floral berry, dried fruit, orange, citrus, sour, alcohol fermented, olive oil, <laughs> my reading raw, green vegetation, beanie, and then we're back where we started, paper mass. And then on the outside, Basically, the flavours combined will be the inner, and then then the outer. The outer to that will be flavours combined, and what it is, and then it will go up and form the flavour of its own. And then you've got. Should we start from there? Caramel, rose. Oh, that's clever. P putting white on white. Um, jasmine. I think that is. Blackberry, raspberry, blueberry, strawberry, raisin, prune, coconut, cherry, pomegranate, pineapple, grape, apple, peach, pear, grapefruit, orange, lime, sour aromatics, um, a, mm, citric acid. Butteric acid, and I have no clue what that one is, and it's too blurry for you to see. But anyway, I can't read all them out. So I'm guessing it's just flavours combined. I'm guessing you take it from the outside and then work your way down. Or you could, oh, I don't know. Well, it's green anyway, so it'd be in this sector here somewhere. I should imagine. And what does it say on it? Um, filter, fully washed, roasted by Hugo again. Whoop, whoop. And red something. And this is aroma is toasted almonds and biscuits. And the taste is cocoa, buttery. Cocoa, but buttery, mouthfeel. 
so it's a buttery mouthfeel whatever that flavor is and so that's the outside of the booklet this is the inside of the booklet and then inside the flap again you've got information about the coffee and the country it comes from and more information here and how to excuse me i thought i was going to burp then and then again the actual coffee again a nice big bag big as my hair and no, i really want to that is 250 grams of coffee so that's good can you see that without the light shining on it there you go <clears throat> now let's rip the top off and rip it off the other side because it didn't quite go there you go ripped off oh i can already start to smell it and it smells lush That smells lovely. Do you want to have a sniff? No, you don't like it. Mm. So that smells really nice. So anyway, what I'm going to do, I'll go to the kitchen now. And you'll see me put it in my pack later and everything. But I won't be switching it on until the morning. Um, so I'll finish it off in the morning once I've filled it up. So yes... I will be testing it in the morning for my first cup of coffee of the day. So when I get up to go to the loo the first time, I switch my percolator on, then come back to bed, and then I wake up to nice fresh coffee already made for me waiting. So that's pretty awesome. So yes, I'll be doing that in the morning, and yes. But anyway, let's head to the kitchen. Right, so here we are at my coffee percolator, and here we go pouring it in. There it is in the bag. And you can see you get loads. Oh. There we go, that should be enough. So there we go. So I'll just add the water and then I'll switch it on in the morning and this will be my morning coffee and when it comes time to pour I will come back not that it be it'll just be like a second time even though I would have had like nighttime sleep ha huh? right and good morning it is the morning now and my coffee is brewed because I got up to go to Lou's switched it on and went back to bed and now I've got my coffee ready so let's pour it into um my mug. And let's pour in the soy milk. There we go. Now let's sit down and go and taste it. Hi and welcome to Essex World. As you already know, it's the morning and I've just made my coffee <clears throat> and now we're going to try it. As you can tell, I'm very tired because the actual time is only 5.55. I've been up since about 4. So anyway, here goes. Mmm, that's really nice. It's got um a warm... I'd say biscuity flavour to it. Um, yes, it's really nice. <sighs> uh, yes, it's a really nice cup of coffee and I can feel it perking me up already. Excuse me. Um, yes, I haven't got the bag because I've put it away. But I've got this with the name on it India India bye bye I think that says um yes uh, what do they say about the flavor oh they say it smells of toasted almonds and biscuits 
and cocoa and a buttery mouthful. Yes, I am picking up the buttery mouthful, I must say. Don't know if I'm picking up the cocoa so much, but definitely a buttery mouthfeel. Not full, even. See, it's too early to talk. But I'm, I'm, I think I'm getting the toasted almonds and biscuit flavour to it. I think I might have added uh, slightly too much soya milk. So that would be the nutty flavour I'm tasting more than the almonds, I think. Because soya milk can taste quite nutty. And I don't use a fancy soya milk, just our pro soya whole bean. Because that hasn't got um, any added sugar to it. Uh, it's 0 0.1 gram of sugar, see? Whereas in the mild, that has a little bit more sugar in it because it's sweetened. Which was the soya milk I started out on. Oh, see, I'm just tired and I'm mambling and speaking rubbish now. Like my mug. <laughs> But yes, this is definitely a nice cup of coffee to have, and it's Indian Bye Bye. And I would recommend it to anyone. I'd also recommend this coffee club to anyone, as I'm loving the coffee that I'm getting so far. Uh, I've got the, the epitome of laziness today, because I'm trying out my new um, thermos flask. So I tip the rest of my coffee in there, and then I just push a button, and... It literally fills my mug up and I thought that's why I've got my soy milk with me so that I can just keep making myself coffees because I wanted to test out my flask before the actual day that I need it so I thought why not to be lazy today <laughs> but anyway that's um, my coffee club coffee direct for this month so if you've liked this video please do give me a thumbs up and also hit that button down below and um, hit subscribe so you don't miss out on next month's one or any of my other upcoming videos and i just hope you have an awesome day everybody and that's all for me from now i think i might have to go back to sleep <laughs> no not really <laughs>